it was a temporal measure to ease the traffic and congestion that had been that had accumulated in the border town. <coughs> we have an association called the MIDA, Malaba Youth Development Association, that uh, predominantly handles the clearance of the airported trucks. The diversion of these trucks to Wakaka affected their livelihood tremendously. And this to us as the, the local authority, we saw the rise in lawlessness, the rise in insecurity, because people, people's incomes had been affected. We have waited for this moment until the 15th of May that the management of customs are decided that the empty trucks should pass in Malaba border. However, with the time restrictions between midnight and 7 a.m. I find this quite unfair to our people given the fact that this is a 24-hour border uh, town. It is our prayer, honest prayer, that these people be given the leverage to operate 24 hours. According to what they agreed with the minister, they agreed empties should be optional. They can pass Malaba, uh, Busia or Wakaka. Which means the decision to start an, at night is temporary as they are trying to test. But as you, you are seeing, the ground is very okay because of the intervention we have put in place.